Welcome to Introductory Statistics using SPSS 2nd Edition. This video shows how to process the chi-squared test. You can watch the entire video or use the time slider to navigate directly to any time point. Chi-square assesses the association between categorical variables. This example involves two categorical variables, gender and ice cream flavor preference. Gender contains two categories, girl and boy. And ice cream contains three categories, chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla. The chi-square will tell us if there's a statistically significant correlation between gender and ice cream flavor preference. If the chi-square renders a statistically significant finding, this would indicate that girls have different ice cream flavor preferences from boys. The other possibility is that the chi-square produces a statistically insignificant finding, which would suggest that there are no significant differences between the groups. In other words, girls and boys have approximately the same ice cream flavor preferences. To satisfy the pretest checklist for chi-square, there should be at least five items per cell. We'll be able to verify the cell counts when we run the actual chi-square test. This example uses the data set CH09 example 01 chi-square.sav. This data set contains two categorical variables, gender and ice cream flavor preference. To run the chi-square test, click on Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Cross Tabs. Move Gender to Rows and Ice Cream to Columns. Click on Statistics, select Chi-square, and click Continue. Next, click on Cells. We'll be using the default, Observed which will render the actual counts in each cell. You can also order the data in each cell to be presented in percentages. In this example, for simplicity, we'll select Observed only. Click Continue. Select Display Clustered Bar Charts. Click OK, and it'll process. As we examine the table, we can see that there are at least five elements per cell. This satisfies the pretest criteria. This table suggests that proportionally, girls prefer different ice cream flavors than boys. The real answer lies in the chi-squared test table. Here we see a p-value of 0 0.001. Since this is less than 0.05, this suggests that there is a statistically significant difference between girls and boys when it comes to ice cream flavor preferences. These findings are reflected in the corresponding bar chart. This concludes this video.